Dinner time mit Maria. Mena. 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 <lacht> Und äh, jetzt essen wir unseren Spieß mit Kartoffeln. Guten Appetit. Thank you. Was ist in norwegisch? Guten Appetit. Guten Appetit. Guten Appetit. Ja. Das ist ja fast das Gleiche. I das ist natürlich gut. Das ist mein Crowder. Das ist deine Kreation jetzt. Okay. So, du kannst das Rezept setzen, wo du willst. Das ist jetzt. Ich kann? Okay. okay. Yeah. Maria's yes. Potato Cream. Ja. Yes. <lacht> Now you got it. You know, 10 years successful in your position, right? Yes. So, Actually, 11 now. 11? And I'm 27 years old. So it starts when you be 16? Yes. How does it come to start with 16? I think that I've been really lucky. My dad is a musician. Yeah. And he knew some people. Yeah. And um, they really liked my voice and the yeah. way I wrote, wrote songs. And so. Did for he some force reason, you a little bit no, or not comes by yourself? Not at all. Yeah? I forced him actually. Oh, okay. I think it made him embarrassed <laughs> that I, I forced him to kind of. Because it is, when your 16 year old daughter tells you she wants to be a pop star, he's like, oh God, not you, you know? <laughs> but it yeah. worked, and yeah. I've been really lucky, and I've worked hard, but I've also gotten some really great opportunities on the way, so. Yeah. But you ever go to a casting show? No. Never. No. no. That was before I started. Yes. Yeah, no, not before I started, it was just around when I started, and then yeah. the idol and the pop star and the yeah. X Factor came. And I'm, I'm kind of glad I, I did it on my own. Yeah. I love watching the uh, these shows, but um, I, I I like the feeling that I know I did it without without that. That yeah, that's yeah. true. So you're traveling a lot, right? So mm -hmm. there's something what you have, uh, something like a must-have, but you got to feel home in the hotel room or something. I, there's a survival kit you always take everywhere. You know, to be honest with you, one of the things I really need to do. And it changed both my lungs and capacity of singing. Yeah. But also just um, in the morning, I have to work out. Okay. I like because I get one hour alone. Yeah. And I get to focus and I get to 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 schwitz. To schwitz, yeah. <laughs> and I, I get to just be alone and think about the day and keep myself in shape. Okay. So well, that what kind of workout do you do? I um, I actually do spinning class when I'm yeah. home. Okay. And when I'm in hotels, I, I do the elliptical machine. Okay. You did this morning? I did this morning at yeah. six o'clock in the morning. At six o'clock. One hour. Wow. Yes. Okay. But it also changed my concerts. Yeah. My lungs and my my stamina is a lot better. So you can sing longer and better. So. <laughs> Maybe something... it's just my imagination. Okay. But it There's does, something it else you do for your voice. Yeah, I like warm training? up. Yeah. Um, and I have a, it's a 15 minute warm up that I have to do. 15 or 15? 15. 15? If I was 50, I'd die. Yeah. Uh, what and kind of warm up is uh, it? It's really, it's ugly. You have to go like, mo, mo, mo. Like it's just really dumb and it sounds really dumb. Yeah. But it works. There's some special food you eat after the show? You no, I try not to eat. I try not to actually eat within two hours before the show. Yeah. Uh, because I have done that before and it comes up in the weirdest ways. Ah, so okay. when you sing, <laughs> there will be burps. Yeah. And uh, yeah, when you sing a song, you're like, and why? <sighs> Then you comes know, a piece of pig that. outside yeah. and you go, <laughs> okay. A piece of pig. <laughs> so your new album is coming out and it's called Weapon in Mind. In Mind. Yes. It sounds a little bit weird because I read. Uh, before we give an interview to the German mm. fan club. It's nice, huh? Mm -hmm. It's nice. And you said your last album is like a candy album. You don't know what to get. It's sweet and sour, but you still like it. And now yeah. the next one calls and Weapon no, in Mind. Yeah, this is an album about the journey to getting to a place where you're, where you're comfortable in your own skin and, and, as a, and, and with other people. Um, and it took me a while to get there mentally, and I'm really proud of it. It also is an album that's a little bit different production-wise. I've worked yeah. with hip-hop producers, and it doesn't sound like that, but my old style combined with those, yeah. their way of making music, I think it really works. Okay. And it's my sixth album. It's crazy, yeah? It feels really good, though. Yeah? Yeah. But it sounds crazy, you know, 26, and this is my sixth album. Yeah. <laughs> How long do you take for this album, to write the songs and it everything? It usually takes about two years. Yeah. Not to actually make an album, but just mm. the whole process of writing. And, and I take my time. I like to take time off 
from the media, but also time off from my job. I think when you work with something that comes from a really passionate place, you also need to uh, take small breaks so that you can miss it. It's necessary this business because you know, bites everywhere. Exactly. Interview here, TV show there. And like it's now. you. And it's you. It's yeah. my. It's me. If I could just, if I could send somebody else. That yeah. would be awesome. Awesome, huh? Couldn't you do that Clonin. with me? You couldn't you do that for me? You can I go be Maria Mena for a day. Like you, you, know? <laughs> you look great. Yeah, but I don't look you great. Need like to you need to grow your hair long. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. And I read that you said in the interview that you don't want to be a superstar because you see what it did to the people, like in the US. Yeah, so I mean, I had the did? opportunity not to become a superstar, but I had the opportunity to, to go to America yeah. and make music. And um, it you was a no? really great experience. No, I did. Yeah. But it wasn't for me. And I think that Why? goes back to the fact that I need some breaks sometimes. Yeah. To be I think to become a huge, huge superstar in the world, you need to have, you need to, I think, relinquish so many things. You need to just put your own life aside and yeah. go for it. And I really respect people who do that. But I don't have that in me. You do Facebook and Twitter? I do Facebook and Twitter. Yeah. And I do Instagram. That's my that's my drug of choice. Ah, okay. Instagram. I am uh, way too much on Instagram. Ah, okay. There's approximately about six pictures a day. Ooh. Yeah, and I might have to take a picture of me. Afterwards. You have to see a doctor, yeah, I that's think. Possible. A little bit of an Instagram <laughs> yeah. doctor. If you know anybody, give me a recommendation. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna Instagram you later. I think. I hope so. Yes. I want to be one of the uh, pictures today, of the today's Special picture. Special pictures of Special the day. Special picture, yeah. Last question is, uh, if you'd be a superhero, or could be, which power you'd like to have? I'd like to be invisible. <laughs> That fits, right. Yeah. So I can go in the boys' locker rooms and just stand there. The I'm boys' locker room? <laughs> okay. No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah. <laughs> no, I'd like to be invisible. Yeah? Uh, wouldn't that be awesome? Awesome. So if I had to go outside and I'd be like, oh, not today, you know? Or like you see a person you don't want to meet. Yeah. Just like turn that on and then walk but past I, that person. But I like flying more. You'd like flying? Able, able to fly? You know, like Superman? But this would be awesome, more than invisible. Invisible! It's the same, you know, if you see somebody, psh, you can fly away. You could go into a bank, just get money and go out of there. You're saying you got enough money with singing, no, so not, why I'm just saying you yeah. could. I'm you not could, saying yeah. I'm, I'm not going to do it. <laughs> or you could just like... Yeah, you could just sit next to people and listen to their conversations. Or go in the boys' locker room. Or go in the well, well, that's my first. That's the first thing I want to do. Yeah, I know. I'm that's why I put it up this. again. <laughs> we got a little one at the end of the dinner time where I say a word, yeah. and you say what comes in your mind. Uh oh, me, Miley Cyrus. Weed. <laughs> Heavy metal. Could be a set, not only black. a word. Black. I just it's yeah, okay. Just the, the color black. Kate Middleton. Baby. <laughs> Hashtag. Hashtag baby. <laughs> Harkon. Huh? I think this is the name Harkoon or how is it? Harkoon? I don't even you, know what that no, is. No, the Harkon, your 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 your, uh, your prince. Harkon. Harkon. Good oh guy. God, ha good guy. Good guy. Okay. Alcohol. Yay. Sex, <laughs> drugs. And alcohol. And alcohol. <laughs> Okay, three words if you die on your gravestone. I was here. Schöne dinner time. Yeah, Mina. Vielen Dank. Thank you for the food. Yeah, you, you prepared. <laughs>